All right, hey, what's up everyone? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to throw playing cards. There's a very specific technique involved and uh, I'm gonna show you the grip, I'm gonna show you the, the motion of the arm and everything, so let's, let's get into it. All right, quick disclaimer, you guys, you have to be really careful when throwing these cards because if you hit someone, like in the eye or another sensitive area, you could really hurt them. So if you are going to have card wars with your friends or whatever, make sure you're wearing eye protection and just be smart. Okay, you don't want to hurt anybody. This, this can be dangerous. All right, so the first thing to talk about is the grip, how to hold the card. Uh, there's a few grips available. This is the one that I use most often. It's really good for accuracy. And uh, here's what it looks like. The first finger is contacting the upper left corner of the card. My thumb is on top. And then my middle and ring finger are kind of just touching the bottom of the card. So it's like this. And the reason this grip is good is because it allows you to spin the card very quickly. The, the card will revolve around your first finger, and then with the right motion, it just you get a lot of revolutions. And that's important. That's like the key thing for card throwing. If you don't spin it fast enough, the card is just going to flutter to the ground. You need to spin it really fast so that it just cuts through the air and travels really far. So get comfortable with this grip. Be able to get into it quickly and without like hesitating or anything. And then we'll talk about how to actually throw the card next. Okay, so the first thing that practice is spinning the card off your finger. So hold the card in the grip that we just talked about. You're going to curl your wrist inwards, and it's kind of like a whiplash thing. Okay, You're going to go from here to here. You just let it roll off your first finger, and it should spin the card pretty fast. Now, this isn't the full throw. This is just the spinning part. We're going to talk about the throw in a second. But just get used to that motion of curling in, and then letting the card fly off of your first finger. Try to get it to spin as quickly as possible. Okay, so we're gonna learn how to throw now. It's actually very similar to throwing anything else. Normally when you throw a ball or something, you bring your arm up like this, and then you go like this, right? Throwing a card, mostly the same with a, a few differences here. So hold the card in the grip that we talked about. You're gonna bring it up. Okay, so you have like this L thing going on. And notice that the face of the card is now facing out. So it's like that. You come down, and at this point, it's both going to be in the arm. It's going to be especially happening in your wrist. You're going to be spinning the card very fast. So you come down like this. This is what happens in slow motion. Your wrist curls in like this. And then you're going to come out, and it's like a flick. It's almost like a whiplash thing. The card is going to spin off your first finger, and it's going to shoot out. Okay, so in slow motion, something like this. Make sense? All right, so I'm gonna do the entire throw in slow motion so you can see exactly what it looks like. Here we go. All right, so if you wanna throw really fast and really far, you can't just throw with your arm. You have to throw with your whole body. So it's like you're throwing a baseball. Okay. You have to bring in your hips, you have to bring in your legs, and there's like a, you're turning your body in the process of the throw. Same thing with the playing card. So let's say my target's over there. I'm going to start off angled kind of like this. So I'm almost sideways to the target. I start the throw, I bring my arm up, and then in the process of flicking the wrist and throwing the card out, I'm turning my whole body and I'm using that momentum or that force to really throw the card fast. Alright, so when throwing these cards, you're going to notice that you might bend the corners. So you want to use a worn-out deck of cards that you might not care about so much. Um, I personally really like these Banshee playing cards. I did a review uh, a while back. I'll put a link for that. They're plastic, and uh, they have like a cutout, so they... Oh, that was a bad throw. <laughs> they keep going. Keep going. They, they whistle. They whistle a little bit. You can hear it, right? So it's just a cool deck of cards. Um, I'll put a link if you want to buy them. Uh, makes you feel like Gambit, which is what this video is all about. And uh, otherwise, just use any cards, just you might damage them a little bit in the process, so be aware of that. Hey guys, hope you liked that video. If you did, please do give it the thumbs up, that helps me out. And I've got one quick announcement before I let you go. So I recently became a moderator for the Card Magic subreddit on Reddit. So if you're familiar with reddit.com and what that website is all about, uh, and you like Card Magic, then you might be interested in subscribing to that subreddit. 
Uh, basically, it's a really good platform for magicians to interact with each other, to ask questions, to share stuff, to answer questions, all that kind of stuff. So um, I'll put the link up on the screen for you to check it out. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Take care, guys.